let me tell you, there's a, I think in football, there's, it is kind of a thankless, uh, you know, not sexy, not, uh, you know, all that, you know, people think, you know, we live these really famous lives and that, you know, we work out in Foxborough, Massachusetts, okay? And it's not like the most glamorous place in the world. And when we travel, we, we're there in and out. We don't, we're not like, like the other sports, they're there for a week. And they, um, football's a very kind of disciplined, you know, routine. It's very monotonous, you know, and the practices is just, it can get monotonous in training camp. And then you have off season workouts. Um, you know, I think it's like 90% just hard, hard work, thankless kind of just get your work done with that 10% reward on Sundays. Then you get to play 16, hopefully more than that, 16 days in the fall and then hopefully more than that uh, in the playoffs. Um, so, but it's those, it's that 10% that is just so alluring, you know, and just makes it so much worth it. And it's, uh, you know, it, it's, it's the greatest game in the sense that there's something about football that, you know, it's shared experience. You know, you're doing it with somebody else. You're not, it's not, you know, you know we love to play golf, and it's a, but it's a very individual sport, you know. Um, I might like the fellowship of playing golf more than I actually like hitting the ball. But uh, football is that. It's the fellowship. It's the guys. It's uh, knowing that we're doing this together. I can't do my job unless he does his job. And it's just more fun to be able to share a championship. Um, and so that's what, you know, that's essentially what football has given to me. And so, you know, it was, it's hard, hard, thankless work sometimes, but the rewards are, for me, were outstanding. When I was drafted in 95, you know, I was going to play for the New England Patriots. And honestly, with all due respect, I had no idea where you guys played. I, you know, I went to high school in San Diego. I never saw a Patriots game. I didn't know it was in Massachusetts is in New England. It was just like way over there. I didn't know, you know. So um, it's when I got here, it was so foreign to me and just so new. And you know, I call it home now. Um, so there's there's a lot of adjusting. You have to, you know, uh, kind of go with what life's giving you. And you know, and, and to be honest with you, the you know the the glamour side for me is. You know, I'm not like Tom Brady where I can walk out and just get smopped. You know, for now, you know what's nice, though, is people now are very reflective when they come up to me. It's not like when I was playing. It's like, hey, you guys going to do it this week or what? You know, and, and in that way, it's kind of like, hey, thanks for, your, thanks for what you did. We really enjoyed watching you. And, you know, and that makes you feel good that you could bring help, bring uh, joy to people on, on a Sunday afternoon. Um, and get them distracted from the, you know, the day-to-day stuff. After a lot of years of pain. Yeah, yeah. You know, so I feel very fortunate 